camera before I get into what I'm about to do. Hi, hi. Harmony, they it's cannot. No. Come on. Give give your sister her egg. Thank you. They're egg fiends. Chocolate egg fiends. I don't know. I thought you just said. Cause he's just like, uh, there's chocolate on this side. Here. Can y'all introduce yourselves? They YouTube hasn't this seen. Is no, no. You know how to introduce yourself. Don't go introduce her. Introduce yourselves individually. So today. Stop. I, so I am a uh, Soleil, and then. How old are you? Five. Okay, that's good to know. Harmony. Come on. Say your name. And I'm six. Wait, better be seven. And then I'm going to be seven, then Harmon's going to be uh, eight. Having a Sagittarius and Capricorn then, cousin is not... Hey, I'm... You're a Sagittarius, Harmony. Feel no. this. No. Is it cold? Yes, get it off my face, please. Told it. Told it. This goes to my face, too. I told them that they could be on the camera for two seconds, and this is what they do. <laughs> Can y'all please go... Say bye to the channel because I got to work. Bye. They're going to go play. They're leaving tomorrow or leaving no. today, actually. No. No. Stop. Ooh, Stop. They're leaving today. They're leaving today. They, have school. Leave they have school that starts tomorrow. I start school tomorrow. So lay back, back, uh, so lay back up from the camera. Go ahead. Bye. I don't want to start school. Bye. You don't have a choice. No. We have a first grader and Soleil, are you going to kindergarten? Yes. Yes. For first grade? Yes. Kindergarten, first grade. There we go. I'm first grade. She's kindergarten. All right, say bye. Bye. They'll see y'all yes. next time y'all come back. I might, yeah. I might put them on the vlog later before they leave. Um, yeah. I'll try, but that all depends on them because they don't like when I be working. So I do like when you're working. Me too. Cause, Cause we come in here a lot. Cause what do I say? Why do I work? Because you need money. No. Wait, you need money. I know, but that's not why I be working. What do I be telling you the reason why I work so much? What do I say? Um, I forgot. <laughs> so we can get rich. So we why? can be rich. Why? I don't know why she acting like she don't know what I be saying. I say that to her all the time. We're already rich. We are already rich, but we need the funds to reflect the bank accounts. Yeah, we <laughs> Hey, y'all. So I promised in the last vlog that I will put Harmony and Soleil on the camera, but... Every time I film, I try to film without them being around because they do too much. But that's Harmony and Soleil. If y'all are new to the channel, those are my little cousins. Um, they are currently, like they said, six and five. Harmony will be uh, seven on the 2nd of December. And Soleil will be six. Soleil will be six January the 17th. So, yeah. Um... They haven't been on my channel in a long, long time. Um, if you're not new here, y'all know the vibes. <laughs> y'all know those are my babies. Um, and a lot of y'all probably gonna be in the comments like, Harmony looks just like you. I promise y'all, I didn't have no kids. If I had a kid, y'all would be the first to know. But I didn't have no kids. She just happens to really, really look like me and she don't look like her mom. Um, I be telling people that and they don't be believing me. Even when I'm out in public, they be like, oh my God, your daughter is so pretty. That is not my child. <laughs> That is not my kid. We are just related, okay? But that's my baby, though, both of them. Um, they do, like I said, leave today because they got school tomorrow. They got to go get their hair done, and I got to do my hair today. So, with that being said, today is the holiday. It's Labor Day. Happy Labor Day. Um, I ain't really shit to celebrate if you want to be honest. Um, your girl has a lot, of st a lot of stuff to do. School starts tomorrow. Yeah, school starts tomorrow. And, of course, I'm in class from 2 to six I'm blowing my shit but besides that being the point um today is going to be the day where i just get my maintenance done the brows is done honey. i don't know if i said that in the last vlog the brows is done babe like they they snatched to the motherfucking gods oh god <laughs> um i don't know if y'all can see my hair is dirty um hence the frederick Douglass look at this very moment <laughs> um i have to get that together so, um, and I've been drinking chlorophyll with ACV, which is apple cider vinegar, if y'all didn't know. Um, I only put a splash of it in my water and then 15 drops of ACV, and this has been helping me lose weight. 
um and it's also i think purging my skin like i feel like my skin is going through like some sort of withdrawal i don't know my skin has been cutting up for like a week and i needed to be presentable tomorrow for school because i'm not gonna lie i low-key want to go to school with a b face i, I don't know I, I don't know if i want to do it to i don't know i don't know because if i could master like a foundationless look we in there how are we in there but um i haven't mastered that yet and um my foundation is very questionable and i have a scar right here that i don't need everybody in my mid about so i kind of want to cover that up but at the same time it's like my face is still kind of broken out so like i don't like i told y'all i don't like wearing makeup when my face is broken out so i think we're gonna see how my skin is looking tonight um early morning because I got to get up super, super early. Because um, I got to get my books and stuff before my class. Because I need my book in class. <sighs> so, there is that. Um, but like I said, today is basically going to be a maintenance day. Um, I'm going to do my hair. I'm not telling you what I'm doing to my hair until later. <laughs> I got to get my gadgets together. Because um, I told y'all we going back to the weekly vlog so and i got a new tripod um if i could find a link to this i'll drop it down below in the comments i got this from best buy like months ago probably back in may never used it um and then this holder just comes with this tripod i had for my mini ring light i'll also link that down below in the comments um i'm not gonna lie i like this because of the grip that it has so i know i'm not gonna have a problem gripping it and i did test out my phone on this um and it works fine so um i'm excited for it um and i also want to take pictures i'm trying to take pictures i need to take pictures um because reb dolls <laughs> is um sponsoring this week i believe if i'm not mistaken um so yeah i got the fit i'm planning the fit fits how i need it to fit it's giving, I feel like it is. I'm not gonna lie, I have the confidence. I have confidence that it's fitting the way it's gonna fit. Um, if not, I do have an alternative. But um, I got the fit, I got the shoes. The shoes is debatable, debatable. But I feel like I can still pull it off, you feel me? Um, my hair, I'm gonna do that. So basically today's maintenance is gonna consist of um, my skin, which I'm gonna do my entire skin routine. I'll probably do that on camera for y'all. And then um, I'm going to probably wash my hair, start the process of doing my hair. Cause y'all know I have a lot of hair and this is a process. I have to shampoo it, deep condition it. Cause I've been, I haven't washed my hair in like a month um, because it was no need to. But now because I've been putting product on it, like gel, it needs to get washed. So I need to make sure it's thoroughly washed um, I gotta blow dry my hair. I gotta get put up, all that, so I can do my hair. Um, I'm gonna basically sleep with my hair in tonight, so that way that's one less thing I gotta do in the morning. All I gotta do is probably like you know, make it cute. Um, uh, so yeah, so skin prep and hair. Oh, and the fit, the fit. I'm gonna show y'all the fit. Um, I'm praying that it fits how it needs to fit. I feel like it is though. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like it is. I'm gonna show y'all the two different options that I'm, I'm giving myself. Um, and I'm, I'm so glad because a bitch got accessories. I got everything that I need. So I'm excited to see all of this get put together. But yeah, today is gonna be a long ass day, bitch. Long ass day. I didn't um, come back with camera yesterday because when I tell y'all my body was on fire. I don't know if it's because I haven't used those muscles in a long ass time, but bitch, my body was on fire, fire. Like the whole, throw the whole back away. Like I, I need to be on somebody's massage table getting a goddamn massage. That's what needs to happen, which will happen very soon. Um, it, it just was a lot. Like I love my job. Like yesterday, I, I, I don't know, like I'm weird. I really, really work well under pressure. It's so weird. It's so, so weird. Um, and I did just that. And I'm excited because I do work um, this week while I'm in school. So I'm going to be filming like how that's, you know, going and stuff like that. So I'm excited. Um, but yeah, girl, that's pretty much it. Skin prep, 
skin maintenance all day today and then my hair um and also the fit so skin prep hair fit period because it doesn't make sense for me to do skin prep fit hair because i need to see the hair what it's giving with the fit like it, it has to be one bit one sound you feel me so um when i start my skin which is about to be in like two seconds i'm gonna come back so you know we can do a thorough skin prep on you know this and yeah and i'm gonna show y'all the fit or the fit possibilities so i'll see y'all hey y'all good morning um <laughs> this is very very impromptu i didn't get a chance to do this for y'all yesterday so we're gonna do it today um i already cleansed my face this smells so good i want to eat it <laughs> And this is the Beauty Bakery, the Swedish Dream Lip Mask. I actually did use this last night because it's a nighttime mask. Um, my lips felt amazing when I woke up this morning. Like, they didn't feel dry. They didn't feel like they lacked any moisture. Like, they felt really, really soft. Um, so, I'm going to use this as the base for right now um, while I do my face routine. My face looks a bit ashy because, like I said, I cleansed my face already. Um, I used a... I use the Teamy Detox Mask, the Teamy Tea Blends Green Tea Detox Mask, the one that everybody raves about. Um, I'm gonna link that down below in the description box. All the products that I'm using right now, I'm gonna link down below. I for my cleanser, I use the Rough and Bumpy Skin, um, CeraVe, Cerav, CeraVe, however you want to say it. Um, <laughs> a cleanser, exfoliating cleanser, um, Cerav, CeraVe. If y'all see this, sponsor your girl. Cause I, I love y'all products. Excuse me. Um, so yeah. Um, and I also used a Freeman's mask. I use it has like mint and something in it. Mint and lemonade. I don't know, but it was for breakout skin because I'm breaking out on my chin. Like I again, I don't know what the hell is going on with my breakouts. So for right now, I'm prepping my face because I'm gonna be doing my makeup, but I'm not gonna do my makeup obviously after until my shower. Um, I'm using the Kiehl's Powerful Strength Line Reducing Dark Diminishing Dark Circle Dark Circle Eye Serum. And I'm gonna, I've seen Shayna. I don't know if y'all watch Shayna Renee. If you don't know who that is, girl, look her up, cause that's my girl. That's my girl in my head. Um, I've seen her apply her eye cream like right here, like directly underneath of her eye. And ever since I've seen her do that on one of her vlogs, I just can't stop doing it. Me personally, I was putting it directly under there, but it's like I don't necessarily have circles under there, at least not anymore. The circles are really like down here. So I'm trying to get these like lifted up. Like they're not bad, but like you see the difference? See how this is like brought up compared to this one? So I love this. This was $30. And I'm not gonna lie, $30 is an expensive investment for an eye serum, an eye cream. But let me tell you something, my eyes have not been dark. And this actually works. And there's a lot, a lot of product in here. Like a little literally goes a long way. You don't have to use a lot. Um, and like I said, despite this being only like this big, it has a lot of product in it. So it's definitely worth $30. I've had this product for over a year now. So it's worth it. Um, next, I'm going to use my, I should have did I be doing this all over the place. I should have did my serum first, then my eye cream, then my moisturizer, or vice versa, but whatever, I'm rushing. So, we're gonna do moisturizer. So I told y'all that I use the Rough and Bumpy Skin uh, Cleanser, so we're gonna use that moisturizing lotion um, because my skin is rough and bumpy right now. I'm just gonna rub that in. My colors are already set out jewelry set out i just gotta pack my cute little bag for um i gotta pack my tripod for content uh my picture tripod so i could get some pictures even if i don't get any full body i still would like like from the the waist up at least um it's gonna be kind of hard trying to find a location when it's raining because it's i feel like I don't know, maybe this is just me personally, but I feel like whenever it's like raining and stuff, the campus tends to be more packed with the locations and stuff because everybody be in and out, traveling from all over versus like if it was hot, people are like all over in different places. Nobody's in one spot because it's hot. But when it's cold and raining, like 
everybody and their mama be everywhere. So, like, I'm not trying to take pictures and it's, like, hella awkward. I'm not usually like that. Like, I usually don't give a fuck because I, I, as y'all clearly be seeing, I, I'm going to put a little bit more down on my chin just to give it some extra love. And the key with skincare is that you want to rub up. You always want to rub up so you don't, so your skin don't like sag. Cause you gotta think every time you pull down your skin, you're gonna your skin is gonna start to sag. So you that's why you always see me like trying to go up and stuff. But yeah, so I'm gonna try to take pictures. I'm excited about that. Next, I'm gonna go in with my Gum Molecules Discoloration Correcting Serum. I cannot wait till I get paid so I can re-up on this twice and get the toner because I'm so pissed that my mom or grandma still don't know which one to this day knocked this shit over and literally knocked half the product out the bottle. So it's like I'm running a little slim on product, but it's okay. I'm just gonna rub it in. I use, I've been using a lot, probably way too much of this, but my skin loves it. So it's really just like, who cares? You know? I'm gonna let that serum set in my face before I use my Rose Quartz Jade Roller. Um, I love this, I got this from Walmart. I, I've had this for like three, four years, hence the packaging. Even the inside of the packaging where the roller is, is fucked. So um, I'm gonna let this set in my face for five minutes. I'm gonna come back on camera with the Jade Roller. Um, I gotta take a shower. Um, I gotta get my hair molded down, but um, off camera, I'm gonna pack my bag up. And yeah, so I'll see y'all. Just give me like two seconds. Give me two seconds. So, I just finished my class, which was sociology. Um, that was lit. I have to, <laughs> almost made me tear up. I forgot I can't be wearing makeup in that class because that lady is always gonna be having the tears rolling. Um, it's currently raining right now. It's like three, almost 3.30. I have a break until about five o'clock. So, I'm kinda irked because at Rowan, like the student center, they're doing construction on the side of it. And on that side where they're doing construction, it's kind of like where I cut through my shortcut to get through the student center to go on to the main road of campus, shit like that. So I gotta go the long way. I'm not happy about that. But the good news is the rain isn't that bad. It's just sprinkling. I was gonna Uber, but $15, $15 to go around the corner? No, I'll suck it up. I got my Telfeezy wrapped around me. <laughs> I'll be fine. So there's that. Um, I have another class at five. I think it's like comp. I'm hungry as fuck. So we finna go to alumni girl, get some food. I'm finna go to Barnes and Noble to grab my textbook. I couldn't do that earlier because the line was too fucking long and I wasn't trying to be late to class. Um, what else? What else? Oh, and we're gonna take pictures in the garage. So. See ya. I'm at my second location for class, right? I'm, so, I'm sorry, I'm whispering, but just, just, just follow me. So, how this building is set up, it's like downstairs, elevator. The classrooms are the reason why you gotta be on the elevator. Cool. Come with the elevator. As soon as you come to the classroom floor, like as soon as you open the door, it's all classrooms. So I'm surrounded by classrooms, hence why I'm whispering. I went to Alumni Grill after my class so I could eat because I'm fucking hungry. Got me mango fried over fries. Chicken tenders. Yo, bitch, I look good. I have to look this 
good and I don't know how long, bitch, I look good. I'm praying I look good. Now I'm mad that I didn't bring my glasses <clears throat> because taking pics against this backdrop, my glasses would have been fire. But it's okay. It's okay. They were just too long for my lashes. I don't like that. I don't like that. <clears throat> right now I'm eating taking pictures being cute in the middle of whatever the fuck was y'all tell me why I thought my build my class this last class was in a different building like behind the garage and it's beautiful in there I actually need to go in there I'm I'm mad I kind of didn't record I'll probably go in there not tomorrow but <clears throat> Thursday it's a beautiful ass building I'm like I know it's fine She's like, no. I'm like, oh. Girl, I put on the GPS and got the walk back. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah, the school's great. I miss you here. It sucks that I'm commuting, but it's okay. It's okay. I got goals I'm trying to reach, and I couldn't reach those goals mentally and emotionally. I was on campus this year, so it's okay. I ain't missing out on this. <laughs> Let me shut up. Um, I'm gonna hurry up and eat. Refresh my makeup. I just reset my face. I probably should have put powder. I probably am. I'm gonna put a little bit more powder. Um, Cause I'm sweating in my T-zone. Take these pictures against this wall just like this. Because, um, yeah. And then, I got class, so. <laughs> Happy first day of school to anybody that started school today. Whether you're in college or, you know. But I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna go eat because I'm hungry. And, you know, boss. Yeah. Bye, y'all. Okay. The thing is, you gotta make the most of whatever it is you do out of life, whatever opportunity you're given. You have an opportunity to be here at Rome, but the outcome is up to you. Okay. Opportunities do not guarantee outcomes. The outcome's up to you guys. Okay. Make that clear to you. Beginning. Uh, use my student email. It's on the syllabus. If you go to Canvas, I'm gonna unlock Canvas after I get done with the uh, presentation. Uh, my student, my official email, for some reason, and they're going to do the course syllabus. So, for now, I'm going to send you the student questionnaire. So, once you do the student questionnaire, you're done with the setting. After you do the student questionnaire, you're going to go to the test area. I'm going to send you an email. Four years here and this is what I did on my first day of school girl it was raining a mess child I ended up going to Barnes and Noble to get my textbook right before my class girl look at this line the line was atrocious I didn't have time to wait in that line so I just left my book in the front of the store look at how pretty I look makeup just a down I'm in my second uber on my way to main campus and that driver gave me a raincoat shout out to him um, that's my first class sociology love that class here. I am walking on the boulevard. I miss my apartment real bad <laughs> I stopped at alumni grill on the boulevard to give me some food because baby 
them chicken tenders and fries bang every single time every time look at the tough easy yo get into it so far sponsor me okay <laughs> i went back to barnes and noble got the same book child yes it was up in the front waiting for me i rented it 70 dollars 70 dollars for a textbook then i had to go to the desk to get this book um for my african-american psychology class i think that's what it's for it's called the bluest eye by tony morrison i'm not gonna lie this book is beautiful and i cannot wait to read it I went to my last class of the day, which was comp one. I've never been in this building before, so it was very interesting. I took my pictures here. Super cute. <laughs> cute. Cute. I love this setup. It was so adorable. Look at me. I'm... <laughs> Chef's kiss, girl. I wasn't lying about them chicken tenders. Them joints smack. They banging. Okay, look at me trying to be cute and eat. <laughs> I played two much girl so here i am in comp one it's only four people in this class i'm like one of five it's crazy crazy i want an imac real bad which color should i get because the gray was cute but i want the pink one and class is over child the day is over i'm ready to go home i went back to barnes and noble to give me a hoodie yes I, I needed that hoodie and i thought it was interesting that barnes and noble had a section called book talk girl Look at this book by Leah. Rest in peace, baby girl. That picture of her is just flawlessly beautiful. I loved it. Um, again, another long line in Barnes & Noble, child. I will never be procrastinating and getting nothing ever again. I stopped by Starbucks, which is inside of our Barnes & Noble. Got me a soda. They don't have nothing there. So don't go to Starbucks thinking you finna get something. And there's my day. <laughs> Your girl's going home. I was tired of being at rain all day. get a chance to come back on camera yesterday because I was tired like that ring being out all day coming home I had to get up at five this morning which was hella hard um yeah I'm here working I'm on my break I'm eating yeah I just got the woodlow work this kind of whatever so I'm excited about that um I'm just tired I just want to nap I just genuinely want to nap <laughs> so funny because the last vlog that I showed y'all I got two job interviews I got one of the two jobs which is my favorite job which is the job that I work right now um this this vlog your girl started work and she got her first paycheck like I just feel like God is so good and listen you gotta do what you gotta do and one thing about it I know how to hustle and I'm gonna hustle every time to get what the fuck I want what the fuck I need because it's not just me no more I have a dog um and if y'all knew here Dior is my dog um my nine month old dog, she's a multi boo, Maltese half uh, poodle mix. She's my ESA animal that I got earlier this year in the midst of my depression. Um, I wasn't able to vlog earlier when I was supposed to at my house because every single day it's a concert. Like I don't know whoever be outside of my building that be blasting music like be at a club or a day party, it needs to stop because it's, it's been happening seven days a week and 20 nights and I'm tired. So I wasn't able to vlog and tell y'all and catch y'all up because the music obviously is going to get copyrighted and you're not going to be, I'm not going to be able to edit that out of me talking. So I'm going to just do it while here while I was quiet while I'm at work. Um, I'm excited. Um, let me just give y'all a little bit of a rundown of what's been going on since I've been messing off camera. So let's go back to, um, cause today's Friday, by the way. That smells so good. I got home by Hermes. Chef's kiss. Um, this past week was my first week of school when lovely. I felt beautiful. I looked so cute. 
I haven't been done up like that in months because as y'all know, I've been in the house all summer, so there hasn't been no need for me to really get done up unless I'm doing like a collaboration with a brand or something like that. Um, I finally took pictures in public and I had fun. Like I just, it just felt fun. It was, it was very fresh, very youthful. I don't know, I loved it. Um, I'm gonna keep doing that consistently. Um, I posted a vlog on TikTok and went crazy viral. They loved it. I love that y'all loved that. Um, it just was fun. It was lit. I'm a week ahead of my assignments, so we're off to a great start for our 4.0 semester. Um, as far as work is concerned, I've literally just been working. If I'm not on camera filming, doing something, or doing an influencer project, I'm literally working. Um, I was off Saturday and Sunday of this week, but your girl's going to be at work um, damn near all day for the next two days. Which is fine by me because, like I said, one thing about it, I'm going to chase that bag and you got to do what you got to do. Um, I got birthdays coming up. Well, my birthday is coming up. Dior's birthday is coming up. We got Christmas. I got trips I'm trying to go on. I'm trying to go outside be at homecoming. I'm trying to do a whole bunch of different things. So, I'm excited about that. I've just been very, very positive with my words. I've just been very, very impeccable with my words. And if y'all don't know, the first agreement, like I stated before, is to be impeccable with your word. And that's exactly what I've been doing. I literally manifested two things in the span of 24 hours and both came true because I spoke positivity behind it. And I was firm in believing that it was going to happen. So, I think we're shifting, besties. I think we're... I don't know something's going on here my aura is bright and beautiful and i'm loving it i'm feeling good i'm genuinely happy um everything happens for a reason i will get into the story time behind my sociology class i probably do that when i get off work i get off of work at like two so um i'm a i'm a <laughs> explain because i don't even have the thingy to show y'all to explain the story and i'm gonna have to insert a clip of what i've seen to make the story it's all gonna make sense, I promise. But um, yeah, and today earlier, y'all saw like clips of me being at the hair store. I didn't really record at the liquor store. It wasn't really much to record. I didn't get anything in either store, but I did find the Sweet Bitch Mango Moscato that I've been looking for at my one liquor store. So yeah, I'm gonna be back to get that. And that's gonna, that's that tastes so good. Like you can literally just drink it straight. You don't gotta mix it with nothing. Um, but today, um, it's Friday, like I said, I went to the doctors earlier with my mom. I didn't want to vlog that because I just felt like that was too personable and it, again, had nothing to do with me. It was all about her. Um, so I didn't vlog. I just decided to be present in the moment with that, hence why there really isn't much footage from today because <laughs> I've literally just been resting, um, doing homework, cleaning, all that good stuff. So yeah, I'll probably unwind with y'all tonight and post that as a video um for tomorrow or something i don't know i'm um, just trying to be consistent with my channel and so far so good um but i do need to post a little sim so i'll figure out what i'm gonna post and uh, as a placeholder for um this vlog until this vlog comes out because i'm not gonna post weekly vlogs until sunday and today's friday so i still got a day's worth of footage basically to capture <laughs> so um yeah but i'm at work hella early i have like well i have 10 minutes now but i got to work uh 20 minutes early which is fine by me because your girl wants to rest stretch um i don't know where i'm going and it's pretty crowded it's pretty hectic in here which is fine because that's gonna make this shift even faster and i'm breaking out can y'all give me like product recommendations on what i can do about this i don't know what this is this is not a normal acne bump and i'm getting a little nervous because it's still not going away like hence it is smaller than what it was before it was like this big kind of um it's not bad now you can kind of see it when i flex my chin a little sometimes like you can kind of see it like you can see it sometimes but you can't um and i'm just trying to get rid of it because i don't know what the hell that is um i gotta clean up my i know i gotta clean my makeup brushes so i hope it has nothing to do with that but at the same time it shouldn't because um I got this before I even put makeup on my face. So maybe me putting makeup on my face made it worse. I don't know. But um, yeah, I'm gonna stop talking. I love you guys so much. And I'm so happy y'all. Like, I, that's really why I've been ducked off. Because I've been so damn happy and just basking in my happiness and doing what I need to do. So I love y'all and I'm gonna stop recording because I feel crazy now because I just seen somebody come near me. And I don't wanna look crazy so I got my phone as if this is not my other job, but it's okay. Um, I love y'all. I'm happy. I hope y'all are happy. Happy Friday. Get lit, get turned. Take a shot for me, okay? Hey, y'all. <laughs> um, Today's Saturday.
today's Saturday. Excuse my room, it's a mess. I gotta learn how to clean it back off. But besides that being the point, your girl's back, back to the back to the job, back to the J O B, okay? <laughs> um yeah, my whole day's gone. I, I literally work all day today, so y'all are not gonna see me until Sunday. Um but I just wanted to come on camera right quick before I went to work just to, you know, talk to y'all. I came in last night. I was cool. I got up. Girl, they tried to have me come in earlier than what I was supposed to. I said, Lord, see, that's crazy because I was actually supposed to get up earlier. Um, just like to get up earlier, but I didn't. I wanted to sleep in a little bit and that's exactly what I did. But it's okay because, you know, the coins are still coming. Okay. The coins are still coming. <laughs> um... But yeah, I'm on my way out the door today, Saturday. Like I said, happy Saturday, y'all. Um, I will unbox some stuff when I come back um, because I got some some stuff that I want to show y'all. Um, let me know if y'all get tired of the PR unboxings. I'm not going to lie. I'm loving them. I'm loving them um, because it's just really, really inspiring me to keep going. Um, I might do like a little unwind with me tonight too. So... Um, yeah but <laughs> like i said i'm on my way out the door um i smell good as hell excuse me dog sierra don't be playing with them scents okay <laughs> i actually need to do a vlog for them like today but i'll probably do it when i come home but i love y'all have a happy saturday enjoy y'all weekend and yeah i'll see y'all good morning good morning y'all I know the lighting is horrible. Just it's gloomy out, it's raining, mind your business. Um I work today. I've been working. I worked a 14 hour shift, I'm tired. I called them and said, Hey, can I come in an hour later? Because 'Cause I'm tired. It's raining. So I'm going into work an hour later. I'm going at eleven. And then I'm coming home and I'm gonna rack some rest, soak my feet, all that stuff. I just wanted to get on the camera and just speak because yeah good morning happy sunday um today also 9 11 so rest in peace to those who lost their lives um during 9 11 i know that was a very very uh shock to the world i don't know how many years it's been honestly 21 we've been i've been through my generation has been through like every disaster known to man and we just keep pushing and striving so just take it easy today remember those who have fallen and passed on and take care of yourself today self-care sunday you know um but i love you guys i'm gonna see y'all later i'm tired i'm trying to really rest as much as i can um i'm definitely not going to be working this hard once the semester starts because I can't. I'm, I'm tired. My feet hurt. Back me on fire. So, yeah. Love y'all. Again, happy Sunday. And then I'll come back on the camera later on when I come back home. <laughs> hey, y'all. So, before I even explain what's in this big ass box, um, I just wanted to close out this vlog. Um, today's Sunday, self care Sunday. I'm going to be starting a new vlog. So, if you see me in this shirt, y'all know the girl. Y'all know the deal. Y'all know the vibes. Um, excuse my mother. <laughs> um, so I'm off of work. Um, I've been off for like an hour now. Girl, I've literally been working. You, you see how quick God works? And that's why y'all need to be impeccable with y'all word. Um, and I keep referring the four agreements, but I'm serious. Because in the matter of a two week span, again, we're going to go over this. <laughs> I got two job interviews. I got one out of the two jobs. And one of the two jobs that I did get was the job that I really, really wanted. Um, I love my job. <laughs> the pay is great. Um, I was able to pick up shifts and stuff like that. And I've deemed myself as being, you know, the one that they can call on, which can be a bad thing sometimes because it's like when they're always calling on you, they expect a lot out of you, which, you know, I'm not people have a high expectations for me. It's not something that I'm not familiar with. Um, but as a worker, like someone who works for nine to five, I'm, I'm always a great worker. Like I bust my ass during my shifts. Um, 
what else uh because I, I i'm 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 rambling <laughs> got the job love my job it's the job that i wanted oh i was i literally manifested the other day on my shift i was like please god give me my my two off days which was today and yesterday please let me work these two days i don't care what the shifts are i just needed to make something shake so my my check can look decent um and i did um i ended up working a 14 hour shift never again never never ever again and if y'all hear me get on this camera telling y'all that i did that just mm, blue screen okay um <laughs> which is again it's fine um and i also got my first paycheck too i got my first paycheck last week um you know every everything is just panning out you have to be impeccable with your word and i should know that my words are very impeccable um i i speak stuff into existence all the time i speak very very positively um, I try to influence my friends, my inner circle around me to speak the same way. Um, you just, you gotta, you gotta do what you gotta do. You know, when you manifest stuff, you have to actually put in the work and God's seeing that I'm working and everything's just working out in my favor. And I love that. Um, but I'm gonna link the four agreements down below in the comments. Let me know if y'all want a video on the four agreements. Cause you know, we could talk about that. <laughs> I just, I don't know if I want to put that on YouTube or if i want to um put that on a podcast i don't know i haven't figured it out yet but i definitely or tiktok i might go to tiktok because i feel like tiktok is easier we'll see we'll see we'll see um but yeah i i'm just happy y'all like i i feel like i just want to rant now <laughs> i'm genuinely happy like i can finally say that I'm happy again and I haven't been able to say that for a long time you know we're in September now the whole first half of this year was very dark for me um if you're new to my channel you might not know but I was suffering from depression um and unfortunately well I, I recently learned this depression doesn't go away which makes sense because I was not I don't want to say I was suffering but I was still feeling a little bit depressed after um my depression subsided and I just couldn't for the life of me figure out what it was and what was going on and if I was going backwards and I was scared. And I think I'm gonna do a video on this too because like I said, I wasn't formally open about my depression here on YouTube. Um, I talked about it on my podcast, but I don't think me talking about it on my podcast did it enough justice, but I'll link that down below as well so y'all can listen to that. Um, but I, I just wanna change this year around, you know? Um, I've suffered depression before, probably five years ago, which makes sense that depression never really goes away um, because here we are five years later, it, it has come back or it came back um, and I overcame it this time, but it, this time it was just so hard. Like I really, really truly felt like I was in a, a dark tunnel, like a dark tunnel with no light. I was the only one in there by myself, by my lonely, and there was no way to get the hell out. Um, and luckily I found my way out. I did therapy and stuff like that. And I do plan on going back to therapy this year, which I'm excited about because I just pray that my therapist that I had last semester is still there because thank God for that lady. Like she really, really, really came through. And like I said, I probably do a whole video on this. Um, so, you know, I don't know, like just looking at me from January to me now, September and the, you know, second to second half of the year, I'm just so proud of myself. And the to know that people around me are proud of me, watching me and supporting me. I, I genuinely, from the bottom of my heart, appreciate that. I really, really, truly love y'all. My close friends, my inner circle, acquaintances, my supporters, my following on all my platforms. I, I love y'all, honestly, truly. Um, because if it wasn't for y'all, there would be no me. There would be no neither brat without y'all. And I feel like I might not say that often, but it's very true. And I want to make sure that I give y'all y'all flowers and show y'all love as well, because y'all deserve it. Um, I love that y'all love me for being me. And, um, that's all I can be, you know, like that sounds like a bar. <laughs> I promise. I promise. I purposely was not trying to rhyme that. I literally, I'm speaking up the top of my head and I'm kind of tired. I'm not going to lie. Um, but yeah, I, I truly love y'all so much. Um, and like I said, I'm just so happy. Like I could cry, but I'm too tired and I don't feel like getting emotional. 
I don't feel like getting emotional right now because we got big news in this box. But um, yeah, I, I just I'm so proud of myself. Like it's y'all, it's hard. I'm 23. I will be 24 in December. I'm still learning. Like just realizing the fact that it's been five years that I've graduated high school. I, I can't get over that. Five years? I, <laughs> I never would like listen. <laughs> I listen. I wouldn't I don't take none of this for granted and I don't think I would do anything different, honestly. I'm learning, I'm loving, I'm healing. Um and I'm, I'm busting my ass. I'm hustling. It's not just me. It's me and Dior, my emotional support animal, if y'all don't know. Um, and that's really what I do it for. That's my baby. Like, she might not be a physical human baby that looks like me, but that's my baby. <laughs> I treat her like an actual human child. So, and she's at my door. She's, she's at my door. Watch. Give her a second. Dior! Watch. You can hear her scratching. Dior. Now she don't want to scratch. Probably because she's messing with my grandma or something, but that was her at the door. Um, but yeah, that's my baby. And she's giving me dog fever because I want another one. Her breeder literally has a dog that looks exactly like her. And I feel like that would just come. My inner child is screaming. Like, I want another dog so bad. And it's not that Dior is not enough. I love that girl to death. That's my that's my baby. That's my dog, obviously. Um, but I don't know. Like, I just, I don't know. I, my inner child is just, I don't know. But, um, yeah, y'all. Say hi, baby. Can you say hi? Can you say hi? Dior. Hi, mommy. Mm -hmm. Yo. Say hi. She acts so camera shy. She she be so fake, y'all. I'm telling you. All right. Bye, baby. Say bye. Say bye. Bye, girl. But yeah, y'all, um, ran over. I'm tired. <laughs> but in this big box, this big old box, guess who decided to sponsor your girl? Take a guess. Take a guess. <laughs> Torrid, y'all. Torrid decided to sponsor your girl. Um, Rev dolls and tour it in the same year like god if this is my year just say that just say that like i am so blessed and happy like i, I really truly am like seriously <laughs> when they reached out girl and i had to get your yeah, pink boots listen haul on the way the haul is on the way okay yeah, and if it's not a haul, it's gonna be a YouTube short. But nine times out of ten, I'm gonna make it a haul. Um, excuse me, because I need content. Um, but I don't want to like go over everything in here because obviously it's gonna be a haul. Um, but I was lucky lucky enough to pick out these pieces. They were not sent to me. Um, like hand picked. I I picked these. Um, and I'm excited coming up with this influencer shit and crazy how like two months ago i literally was telling y'all i was stressed out i wanted to quit and now look see how god worked god is working overtime for me and god i love you i appreciate it. you big god yeah <laughs> but um i love y'all like honestly truly if i can give y'all a hug a dutch a shot maybe a little money i would <laughs> But um, I truly, truly love y'all. And I'm going to see y'all in the next vlog. Uh, yeah, I'm going to see y'all in the next vlog. If you're not subscribed, at this point, you're missing out, baby. you you missing out. I'm the life of the party. Okay? <laughs> Bye, y'all.